Hi everyone, Edward Current here. Today I'd like to tell you about an amazing passage from the Bible. Turn to the book of Mark, chapter 16, verses 17 and 18. And these signs shall follow them that believe. In my name shall they cast out devils. They shall speak with new tongues. They shall take up serpents. And if they drink any deadly thing, it shall not hurt them. Did you get that last bit? In other words, if you're a Christian and believe, you are immune to poison. It says so right here in the Bible, in the New Testament, and one of the Holy Gospels, no less. Isn't that something? Now, I asked my pastor about this, and he said, yes, if a man is true of heart in his love for the Lord, the Lord will protect him who believes. But he also said we should never set up a foolish test for God or tempt God the way Satan tempted Jesus. But still, that doesn't mean I can't celebrate this blessed gift from the Lord here on video, right? I'll drink some poison and live. <laughs> and hey, if some non-believer happens to see this and learns about the truth and light of our Heavenly Father, well, that wouldn't be so bad, would it? So check it out. Here I have a bottle of potassium cyanide. It contains twice the lethal dose for an adult non-believer, and it would kill an atheist in less than 30 seconds. <laughs> but I'm going to drink it and kick back in blessed immunity. And hey, even if something were to go wrong, although it won't, because the Bible is the word of God, and I believe in his word in my heart, I'd just go to heaven a little quicker than planned, right? And heaven is awesome. Okay, here we go. Dear Lord, bless this bottle of deadly poison, and through your love and grace, deliver me from its harm, so that it may give me the strength to better serve you, my Lord and Holy Father, with all my heart, in your name, Father God, and in the name of Jesus of Nazareth, the Christ, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Ugh. 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 Very bitter. Tastes like almonds. Very strong almond taste. Well, that wasn't so bad. Glory to our Holy Father, through whose love and grace he issues forth redemption and... Mm. Oh, something's wrong. Oh, 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 this is bad. Mm. Oh, 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 fuck, what have I done? Mm -mm. Oh, oh, God, oh. I don't want, I don't want to, do oh. The estate of Edward Current apologizes for the technical difficulty that occurred in the making of this video. We request that other believing Christians honor Mr. Current's memory by submitting video responses in which they drink lethal doses of poison and survive. The estate of Edward Kern assumes no liability for any damages that may result from this request. Any actions performed by the viewer as a result of viewing this audiovisual program are hereby done at the viewer's own risk. The viewer hereby releases the estate and any and all entities associated with Edward Kern in the material or non-material universe from any and all future claims that may or may not be brought against the estate or associated entities in any court of law, process of judgment, or jurisdiction.